border layout in java what is border layout in java and how can we implement in the functionality of a border layout in java programming in the previous video we have discussed about flow layout and now we are going to discuss about border layout hello everyone i'm sukanya from goedu hub technology and to begin with firstly we will discuss about layout manager the layout manager are used to arrange components in a particular manner layout manager is an interface that is implemented by all classes of layout managers there are classes that represent commonly used layout manager those are java.awt.borderlayout java.awt.flowlayout java.awt.gridlayout and similarly java.awt.gridbaglayout now the border layout is used to arrange the components in five regions north south east west and the center so the border layout provide five constraints for each region that is public static final int north similarly for south east west and center now there are several constructors or method also for border layout class and those are border layout it simply creates a layout with no gaps between the component now there is a j border layout int horizontal gap and int vertical gap if you want to mention the gaps between the component then you can use this particular construct so in this program also we will import firstly all the packages of awt and swing and we have created a class border 1 similarly we have created a frame also j frame f and the border 1 the particular constructor is used and then what we have done a border layout example the new j frame we have set like this this type of a frame is set next we have added buttons like north east west south and center and then we have added all the frames all the buttons to the frame j frame using b1 and border layout in the north similarly b2 for south and with respect how you want to add in which particular layout you have added that this is the name of the button which will the display on the button but this is how we are adding into the borders we have set a site and f set visible is true and then we have new border one border created and this is how the border layout is made so now firstly i am going to write this program and then i will execute it and show you that how border is actually made you can see here that i have written the program and saved my file as proc2.java which i'll use during compilation and as i have explained to you all the buttons are added to the frame and then the border layout has been mentioned because we have two con constructor which we have studied or the methods in border layout that border layout dot at which particular border you want to set that button you can set it so firstly i have compiled and now there are no errors and now i have to run the particular class file and the class file is border 1 which is generated after compilation so let me run that particular class file and see that how actually these buttons are aligned with respect to the border so as i run the class particular class file generated here you can see that a border layout example file is made okay so now you can see it very clearly border layout example the name of the frame is there and the buttons here are set center this is north this is for east and this is for south so this is how all the buttons are made and this is how the border layout example works for more layout examples we will look into upcoming videos thank you